We're going to be performing the tectoral membrane test, and this is really assessing the mobility or hypermobility between C2 and the occiput, and so we're going to be doing it in the supine position. And when we do this, what you're going to be, uh, have their head kind of towards the edge of the table, and then you're going to come around and find the C2 spinous processes, and then you are going to grip their occiput and then use your chest to flex their head passively into about 45 degrees of flexion so that way you don't have to hold it the whole entire time. So get a good stabilizer on those transverse processes and then with your my right hand, you're going to apply traction on their occiput and see what kind of distraction you can get there. If they complain of nystagmus or concordant pain or anything else along those lines that is a re, uh, reproduction of what their problem is, that would be a positive test. This test is actually highly sensitive and specific, so a good test to look for issues uh, between the occiput and C2.